this is a jar I had the white underwear in. I had it in uh, water and baking soda trying to get some stains out of there. It's been uh, in there since uh, September 2013. Today is uh, December 8th. And uh, it looks uh, to be still wet. The stains are. Uh, seem to have uh, resisted uh, persisted and uh, there's also a bit of uh, mold I think that black stuff I'm not sure what that is accidentally dropped the jar while I was setting up the camera for another video I knocked it over and that's what happened to it Seem to be some interesting reflections coming off the pieces of glass. Maybe that's the baking soda over the last uh, three years. of the age I uh, kept this jar as a talking point a sort of uh, point of interest you know when uh, my uncle came right after I put the jar up he came from Australia and uh, he uh, caught it immediately after entering my room and <laughs> at that time it was very embarrassing but I thought it was amusing <laughs> as well
that uh, can uh, represent either a source of extreme shame or extreme boldness and uh, liberation from uh, the uh, prejudices the judgmentalism of others you know it says I'm not gonna care what you think I place my underwear <laughs> soaking in a jar as a center point in my room. Uh, you can think whatever you want about it so when it comes down to it We all uh, have to deal with the same issues, even very in terms of the most private and uh, personal matters so this is what a three-year-old underwear that has soaked in a solution of Baking soda and uh, water looks like it's still very wet. See. has uh, no smell yep maybe a hint of detergent but nothing else oh well 
the garbage with it. This I will not hoard for sentimental reasons. But uh, I am somewhat saddened to lose a centerpiece in my room. Maybe I'll put a replacement just uh, to continue peaking visitors interest and uh, let them have their provocative thoughts